Hi everyone, welcome to Save Lectures. I am Sneha Reddy came up with the topic of Asmara Chikitsa. The most important topic for exam. It has been asked repeatedly as a long question. I am going to make you understand and remember the topic easily. I have covered all the points which are to be included in long answer. You just need to follow the video till the end. Let's start. What is Apasmara Roga? Apasmara is a Manasa Roga in which patient suffers from episodes of Apasmara Vegas. Apasmara can be correlated with epilepsy of modern science. Moving on to the Nirukti of Apasmara. The word Apasmara is made up of two words. Apa plus Smara. Apa denotes deprivation. Smara denotes memory. Hence, loss of memory. Let us turn on to the Paribhasha. A small and important slok of Paribhasha given. Apagata Smrutihi Yasmin Roge So Apasmaraha. It means person loses his smruti, that is memory in a apasmara roga. Now we will see nidhanakara factors. Sharirika nidhanas are asuchi bhojana, vishama chesta, vega dharana and manasika nidhanas are chinta, kama, bhaya, krodha, shoka, udvega, etc. Here I used mostly Sanskrit terms. If you use them in exam, it will be impressive and you can score more. Now take a look at Samprapti. Due to Nidana Sevana, both Manasika and Sharirika Doshas such as Raja, Tama, Vata, Pitta, Kapha gets Prakopa and these Prakopita Doshas enter and localizes in Rudaya. Rudaya here it is referred to brain and fills up the Manu and Sangnyavaha Shrotas. This leads to Smriti Nasha and patient suffers from episodes of Apasmara Vegas. Now we will look Purva Rupa of Apasmara. Hearing of non-existing sounds, salivation, stiffness in the heart, frequent abnormal movement of eyes, feeling of darkness in front of eyes. Now we will see the Lakshanas. The main symptom or Lakshana of Apasmara Roga is patient suffers from episodes of Apasmara Vegas. That is attack of seizures with symptoms such as loss of memory, loss of consciousness, feeling of entering into darkness, throat discharge from mouth. These Vegas may occur once in 15 days or 12 days or a month. The attack may however takes place even at the shorter periods. Moving on to the types, mainly these are of four types. Vata Japasmara, Pitta Japasmara, Kapha Japasmara, Sannipata Japasmara. Let's look at Sadhya Sadhyata. Apasmara is Sadhya in Sannipata condition and in weak patients. Moving on to the Apasmara Chikitsa, the most important part of this topic. Here comes the shloka which is very important. We must write Chikitsa Sutra Sloka in exam and that completes our answer. Taira Vrutanam Rutshroto Manasam Samprapodanam Tikshno Rado Bhishak Kuryat Karma Bir Vamanadi Bihi Vatikam Basti Bhuishtai Paitya Prayo Virichanaihi Slaishmikam Vamana Prayer Apasmara Mopachareet The shloka reference is from Charaka Chikitsa Sana 10th chapter 14th and 15th shloka. Meaning of this shloka is, firstly, occlusion should be removed from Manuvaha and Sangnyavha by administering Tikshna Shodhana, that is, in Vataja, Basti, in Pittaja, Virishna and in Kafaja, Vamana Karma should be administered. When Apasmara patient falls unconscious, we should administer Nasya, Pradamana Nasya, Dhupana, Anjana to regain consciousness. Nasya by using Trifala Dittaila, Dhupana by using Mustadivarti, Kayasya Divarti. However, patient regains consciousness by Nasya, Dhupana, Anjana. But to cure the disease, we should administer Shodhana and Shamana Aushadas. Firstly, Snehapana and then Svedana should be done for Shodhana purpose. Basti should be administered in Vata Japasmara, Pirechana Karma in Pitta Japasmara and Vamana Karma in Kapha Japasmara. Then advise Samsarjana Krama to follow the diet which includes Old Shali, Shastika, Mudka, Yusha. After Samsarjana Krama, Apasmara Roganashaka, Grutapana, Abhyanga, Utsadana, Apasechana should be given considering the Dosha Vishyesha. Mainly these five steps are important in treating the Apasmara Roga. Let's look at the Samshamana Chikitsa. Grutapana is best in treating Apasmara. Grutas such as Brahmi Gruta, Vachadi Gruta, Mahapanchagavya Gruta, Amlakadi Gruta, Jeevaniya Gruta, Panchagavya Grutas are used. These Grutas can be remembered by correlating with the sentence Brahma, Vishnu, Maheshwara arrives and gives Jeevanadana to Panchagavyas 
who were suffering from apasmara here the word brahma denotes brahmi gruta vishnu denotes vachadi gruta maheshwara denotes mahapanchagavya gruta arrives denotes amlakadi gruta and jivanadana denotes jivaniya gruta panchagavyas are panchagavya grutas counseling plays major role in apasmara chikitsa to reassure the patient about his health condition abhyanga performed using sarshapa taila cooked by adding four parts of gomutra after that apply cow dung for utsasana purpose and gomutra is used for avasechana medya rasayana advised to check the reoccurrence of the apasmara roga thanks for watching you will get new video on every monday and friday so to get notified do subscribe and press the bell icon if you want me to make video on any topic please do comment below and let me know do like this video to keep up my confidence